Hey everyone, look what it is. So I never finished, it, it's pretty infamous on my channel that I never finished Marathon Deal for a professional run because I got extremely angry at one part. Now I have completed the game on professional before and I have a save to prove it. Um, but I just never fin I just never went back and finished it because I got to the point where I had to do an extremely difficult section of the game where I, with no healing items and enough health that I would die in one hit to anything. Um, which my fault for getting that situation. I could have backtracked and redid sections, but I just, I got so angry after trying it for hours and hours that it's just, I never finished it. So people have been getting on me to finish Resident Evil 4, and I happen to have a Steam copy of the HD version. Sadly, I can't play it, I don't think I can play it on Professional, like I did with, um, the PlayStation 2 Let's Play I started, because... I don't have any save files for this, and if I remember correctly, you have to beat normal mode before you have access to professional. So we're going to be playing it on normal mode, I believe, unless it gives me the option to, and then we're going to have to have a discussion. But, yeah. Let's play some Resident Evil 4. Yeah, yeah, I don't have the option to go into professional, so we're going to play it on normal. Resident Which sadly Evil means that I can't 4. have the Tommy gun, or the suit of armor that I did in my, um, other playthrough, but... 1998. I'll never forget it. It was the year when those grisly murders occurred in the Arklay Mountains. Soon after, the news Zombie? was out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment oh, conducted I play this by game the forever. International Pharmaceutical Enterprise. Um, I used to play the shit out of this game. The virus broke out in a nearby mountain community, Raccoon City. Also, I'm wearing makeup. How's it look? little <laughs> I usually don't wear makeup in my videos anymore. World crippling its very foundation. Not taking any chances, the President of the United States ordered a contingency plan to sterilize Raccoon City. So I can't remember which one is canon or not, With because this public, makes it look like it was nuked. The United States government issued an indefinite suspension of business decree to Umbrella. Some other things make it look Soon like Raccoon City was nuked. Crashed, and for all intents and purposes, but... Umbrella other finished. versions make it look like it was just bombed. Depending on which game you play or which thing you watch, some look like it was nuked, some look like it was just bombed. But Six years that makes it look like it was since that horrendous incident. Anybody who plays Code Veronica and then plays this is like totally different. Like, what happened to her? I received special training via a secret organization working under the direct control of the president. I was to assume the responsibility of protecting the new president's family. Cornell, why am I the one who always gets the short end of the stick? Yo. There's no subtitles because the game wouldn't let me turn them on. I hopefully it does in game. There's an option for it. It just wouldn't let me turn them on. You have my sympathies. Guess that's a local's way of breaking the ice. Anyway, you know what this is all about. My assignment is to search for the president's missing daughter. What? All by yourself? He's a one-man army, dude. I'm sure you boys didn't just tag along so we could sing Kumbaya together at some Boy Scout bonfire. Oh my god, I missed then this dialogue! Maybe you did. <laughs> oh, you crazy American. It's a direct order from the chief himself. I tell you, it's no picnic. I'm counting on you guys. <laughs> Which means they're going to die within the first five minutes of the game. <laughs> See, I could hit escape to try and put subtitles, but I don't want to accidentally skip the cutscene because I can't remember what button skips cutscenes. <laughs> it was right so. before I was to take on my duties of protecting the president's daughter when she was abducted. Gross. That's the ultimate reason I'm in this lonely and rural part of Europe. According to our intelligence, there's reliable information Is that about Alice sighting Buckner? of a girl that looks very similar to the president's <laughs> daughter. Reason he has gold. Apparently, she's being withheld There's by some unidentified rabbit group of people. On my microphone. Who would have thought that my first job would have this been a rescue now. mission? This is my life now. And Doris just gave me a weird look. Ah, it's freezing. So cold all of a sudden. Demons! Originally, this game was going to include demons and goats. Uh, must be my imagination. <laughs> and originally, it was Sorry, going to be double so crack. Uh. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, you can still find footage of the original version of this game, and Leon is literally fighting ghosts. I think they justified in that he's infected and is hallucinating, but still. Just up ahead is the village. Okay. Shoot him in the face. I'll go and have a look around. Yeah, we'll stay and watch that car. Don't want to get any parking tickets. Right. Parking tickets. Good luck. Dude, you're the police. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Jeez. Who are these guys? They're gonna Did die. They're gonna die in a couple minutes. It's fine. Leon. Hey there, Hanigan. I'm Leon Hanigan. I'll be your support on this mission. Loud and clear. Somehow I thought you'd be a little older. She has such so moe, like Ashley anime Graham, moe right? eyes in the right. HD version. She's the daughter of the president. I so never noticed yourself, that in the original. Okay? <laughs> Whoever this group is, they sure picked the wrong girl to kidnap. I'll try to find some more information on my end as well. Good. Talk to you later. Leon out. <laughs> Her eyes! They're so big in my way! Okay, can I please do the thing? I thought it was there somewhere. The fuck? Where is it? There's definitely... an option for- See? It won't let me! It won't let me do subtitles. I'll be right back. So, just spent a second, exited back to the main screen, took a look at it, googled a couple things. This game doesn't have English subtitles. The PlayStation 2 version has English subtitles. This game has no English subtitles, it only has partial English subtitles when you play the game with a different audio language. What? That's so stupid, not only for, like, people who are, you know, deaf trying to play this game. The PS2 version, and the GameCube version, and the Wii version, they all had subtitles. Why? Granted, this HD version was made when Capcom was crap. I mean, they're slightly better now because of Res Resident Evil 7, but this is so dumb. I'll have to look and see if maybe there's a mod online to put the subtitles in, but for now, sorry, no subtitles, because we can't have nice things. Oh, this is going to be interesting. I'm not using a controller like I normally would. I'm using the keyboard. Okay. Uh-oh, it's a demon! You can't reload? Where is my reload button? Oh, right. <laughs> That's how you know it's been a while since I played this game. Okay. Okay, so that's what does that. Being around the Leon. Trying to remember my controls. Awesome. I do like being able to control it with the mouse. It's gonna take some getting used to, but I do like it. Okay. There's my map button. Got it. Okay, time for the fight. Hello. Uh, excuse me, sir. I just broke into your house through the front door. Yeah, no. I was wondering if he might recognize a girl in this photograph. Why does he assume that they speak? Sorry to have bothered you. Yeah, I'm like, why does he assume that they speak English? Also, he broke into their house. Freeze! It's in freeze! Bitch, he ain't freezing. Nope! What? No! 
I wanted to knife him to death. Screw you, game. <laughs> oh, balls. Those other guys are screwed. Because they didn't come with me. I gotta talk to Hunt again on the on the radio as Is dudes okay? are converging on my There's location. There's a hostile local. I had no choice but to neutralize him. There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. Take whatever measures necessary to save the subject. Understood. Ahí está! Ahí está! Ahí está! Ahí está! Oh god, tank controls. <laughs> I forgot about tank controls. Oh. Sometimes I thought it was space bar that was that. And, um, no. Nope. Nope. Uh, nope. 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 Okay. Get him with the knife! Get him with the knife! Kill him! Yes. Best way to save ammunition in this game. Kill everything with the knife. If I remember correctly. If I remember correctly. Aha! Gotcha! Wake. See, I still remember part of this game. And I haven't played it in a couple years. <laughs> I think I played a little bit of the HD version on stream at one point, but it wasn't much. I hear I hear Huey! We gotta rescue Huey! We'll rescue Huey in a minute, because I got shit to do. Like, saving. Oh. The save music. I, I missed it. Missed it so much, yo. Love this game. Love this game! Popper! Worth it. <laughs> okay, how does a crow carry 400 pesetas? And how does a crow carry a, ha carry a hand grenade? Huey! For those who don't know, this dog, direct reference to Haunting Ground. This dog right here, yeah, that's Huey. That's Huey. No. Yeah, yeah, it is Huey. No, yeah, it is Huey. Okay. Somebody says getting Huey and Brown mixed up for a second. Um, but that entire thing and the, what happens later during the El Gigante fight when you re after you rescue Huey, absolute reference to um, Haunting Ground because they came out around the same time, I think? Or Haunting Ground came out a little bit after this? Hello. I can aim so much better on this. And... No, I want to hit him in the head. What? See, I'm not I'm not moving the gun, but it has a little bit of a wobble to it. Which makes sense. That's still annoying, so I'm gonna shoot him in the crotch. Wait for it. You're just gonna stand there? Dude, I want you to come and blow up. Nerd. Fine. Be that way. If I remember correctly. Yep! <laughs> this is how you know that I've played this game a bajillion times. I can still remember, despite the fact I haven't touched this game in over, well over a year, something like two years. Maybe even more than that. So, like, I remember shit. Just like there's gonna be a dude in there. Hey, I see a dude. I it's done. They are still just standing there. I want my sniper rifle, please. Here he comes. Here he comes. Yeah, I speak some Spanish, but not that much Spanish. Hey <laughs> Oh, I want to stab him. Weird. Yep. 
Wait, how about a hit? Yes! Are you gonna come after me now? No. I can't remember, there's something to do in here. No. Okay. I also can't run and shoot. Because they haven't added that to this game yet. Hi. How about I do this? What? I hit you in the knee. You're supposed to go down when I do that. Oh. Oh. Okay, fine. <laughs> okay, fine. I'm gonna check through here. Okay. Oh, dear. Yeah, it's gross. That's the grossest lady uh, attached to the thing with a pitchfork. It's a wooden box. Bam! It's now pieces of a wooden box because I have the most powerful knife in existence. So this game actually used to scare the crap out of me when I was little. I would have to have all of the lights on and I would have to put something barring my bedroom door before I played it because it scared me. Oh no, a dude! You can't kill those guys, by the way. Oh no, there's a dude in there. Oh dear. Oh, one button. There we go. Hi! No! And that is how you kill dudes in this game. You shoot them in the knee so they can't be adventurers anymore, and then you knife them in the spoon. Okay, this next part is probably going to get me killed. <sighs> but then again, I am on normal, and I'm used to playing Leon, it on professional. How you so. holding up? Bad question, Hunnigan. Sorry to hear that. I'm sending you a playing manual. Leon kind of looks useful. sickly oh, pale in the Thanks. HD version. I can barely remember what he looked like in the regular version, but he kind of looks sickly pale during the radio calls. Okay, I know how to play this game. Don't patronize me. Oh my god, it's a dud. It's, it's... It's a dud. And another dud. Oh dear. I'm back out now. So, I'm gonna try something. This is probably not gonna work. Damn it! <laughs> Sometimes you can get over here and get the weapons before triggering the cutscene, but. Sigh. Okay, come at me, nerd. What? Can't get me. Oh, come after me, nerd. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Okay, do I have a bomb? I do have a bomb. No. Do I exit? There we go. Yes. Might as well take care of three of them if you can. Uh, what? Oh, balls. Cool story, nerd. Uh, nope! <laughs> so, I know this is less fun to watch. But this is a better way to take care of the scene, in my opinion. Oh, hey, that was rude. Did you not? Oh god, my controls. My controls. My controls. Okay. Okay, that was rude. Did you not? Could, could you like not? Okay, I gotta use the fucking first aid spray. Oh Jesus! <laughs> oh Jesus! Oh, 
I'm gonna run out of ammunition. Hi. Did not. <laughs> nope. <laughs> and then we just went back this way. <laughs> so this is probably a conventional way to handle this scene, but fuck it. Okay, that was weird. That was also weird. This is going in poorly for me. Yes. Yes, yes, it's quick. Okay, um... Combine that and use and oh god. Now this is gonna end poorly for me, it looks like. Seeing as I'm all out of health items, I'm gonna die already! wait them out. And yes, I know I didn't trigger either of the chainsaw dudes. Because fuck doing that on a first time playthrough. Even if it means getting the shotgun, because I can just get the shotgun now. Lord Sutler. Because once they go, I must go to church because we have no mind of our own. I can just loot the entire town. Where's everyone going? Bingo? Yes. Yes, Leon. In an obviously infected, crazed rural town in Spain, they're going to bingo when you hear a Honey, church bell. I have some bad news. I've confirmed the body of an officer. Something's happened to the people here. Leon, you need to get out of there. Look for a tower and follow the trail near it. Got it. Got it! Okay. So... I mean, I'm not dead. I managed to do it in one try. <laughs> Which is somewhat surprising to me because I didn't think I was going to manage it in one try. Uh, I did lose all of my health though. Like, just about all of it. But, I'm going to loot the village and take everything. It's quite a lot. It's going to take a minute. So I'll see you then. <clears throat> hey look! I found a note! <laughs> Alert order! <gasps> they have pictures of me, stalkers. Recently there's been information that the, a United States government agent is here investigating the village. And do not let this American agent get in contact with the prisoner. For those of you not yet informed, the prisoner is being held in the old house beyond the farm. Thanks for telling! You know that American agent did. And just leaving this note here for anyone to see. We will transfer the prisoner to a more secure location in the valley when we are ready. The prisoner is to stay there until further notice. Meanwhile, do not let the American agent near the prisoner. We do not know how the American government found out about our village, but we are investigating. However, I feel that this intrusion at this particular time is not just a coincidence. I sense a third party other than the United States government. Other than- I sense a third party other than the United States government involved here. Grammatically, that should be the United States government is involved here, but- My fellow men, stay alert! Chief Vitoris Mendez. This boss fight is going to fucking suck. But either way, I realized the motion blur was on. Because I was starting to get dizzy. So I checked and went, wait, there's a motion blur option? Turn that shit off right away. Fuck that noise. Might get it. What? No, I want to hit. There we go. <laughs> I know, I hit the thing. Mm -hmm. Shut up, phone. I gotta kill a dude. Is it just me or is there more... I'm gonna shoot in the crotch. Um, there's more, like, wobble to the gun than there was in the PlayStation version. Bro! That's how you kill a dude. Just like that! There's somebody, yep, there's somebody over there, too. Hey, dude! Wait a minute, somebody's walking towards me. Oh, hi! <laughs> oh, hi, 
Mr. Glitching into the doorway. How you doing? Bro! <laughs> what? Fuck you. <laughs> nah, bro. <laughs> nah, bro. Okay, there's chickens over there. I got a present for you. It's called my knife in your back. Now we get the note. About the blue medallions. So, seven in the farm, in the cemetery, for those of you who destroy ten or more, will be rewarded. But we want to destroy all fifteen of them before you turn it in, because then we get the pistol. Um, I can't remember the name of the pistol. But we get a pistol if we do everything, though. And before, If we do all fifteen instead of just ten. Then we get a better pistol. Or an upgraded pistol. It looks safe point. Not gonna worry about that safe point just yet. Because I've got shit to do. And by that time, I mean I'm going to just glitch out the screen. Because it's funny. No. There's still dudes. I think. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure there's still dudes. You guys want to see, like, the only dog in this game that's not infected? I thought he's around here somewhere. There's one dog in this game that is not infected. I mean, besides Huey, obviously. And he's around here somewhere. Chickens! Oh, poor chickens. I'll, I'll leave the chickens alone. <laughs> Where is he? I heard him. I heard him bark. There he is! The only dog in the game that's not infected, as far as we know, with Las Plagas. Because <clears throat> he's not acting like the other dogs, and by that I mean he's not shooting tentacles out of his face and trying to kill me with them. Hi. Hi. Boom! <laughs> Gotcha! Gotcha! <laughs> so now we are yet again in the Scarlet Loot Everything and Shoots Everything Else portion of the game. Because I've killed all of the enemies in the area. Never mind, no I didn't. Hi, how you doing? No. Shut up, Vaughn, I'm trying to record. Okay, you know what? No. Hey, dude. How you doing? <laughs> the knife is your best friend in this game. It just is. Um, I believe. I believe. I was right. Boom! Okay. See, all of my memories are coming back because I did. I, I played the ever living crap out of this game when I was younger. Uh, how many more did they say? I said there were seven here. I'm not going to do writing time right now. Okay, so we- Oh, 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 okay. I'm, I know where they are. I know! I am aware of where the things are. Oh! Ammo mission! Ammo mission! English Scarlet motherfucker, do you speak it? No. <laughs> I speak bad English though. Okay, okay, my aiming is better than this. <laughs> I swear. Just you wait till I get this freaking sniper rifle, dude. Oh, I had to do it. Also, it's not my fault that the game has wobble. So this area is not important until we get Ashley. Yeah. Because I can't unlock that door until we have Ashley. Is there a dude in here? No. Okay. For some reason I distinctly remember there being a dude in there. It might be on just professional or it might just be during the nighttime section, but I know there's a barrel. We should break it. Because breaking things is fine. Especially when they're not yours. Don't break other people's stuff, you guys. 
it's rude. <laughs> do as I say, not as I do. It's a box. I keep hitting E instead of hitting the right button. I got a beer sign! We're gonna get drunk! Gonna get so drunk! Absolutely drunk. One bajillion percent drunk. Oh, the egg vanished. Oops. So, after all of that loveliness, because it's been 38 minutes, I'm going to end the video here. And in the next one, we're gonna go find ourselves a friend. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I have been playing some Resident Evil 4. I'll see you all in the next video.